this was a sovereign citizen. He was Moorish. Hey guys, good to see you back. We're going to be taking a look at a news piece that's from yesterday. Happened last night, I believe. Uh, Sheriff Judd Gred down there in uh, Florida just posted this video on a, a local news station. It appears that uh, we have one less Moorish American citizen with us because he got into a shootout with the police. And it didn't end well for him. Two of the officers were hurt pretty badly. But here we go. Good morning, everyone. Thank you for being with me this morning. I also have with us uh, Brian Haas, our state attorney, and I'm eternally grateful that you came out and spent all night here with us. Let me tell you what happened. It started about 1222 this morning, Saturday morning. We've had burglaries of vehicles where people haven't locked their doors and people are flipping handles. We also recently had some burglaries at a concession stand at the Hunt Fountain Park off Duff Road in North Lakeland, which is where we are. So we had deputies assigned to the area as a hot spot, and Deputy Conover did exactly what she was supposed to be doing, checking out suspicious vehicles. The county park closes at 10 p.m., and she noticed a white vehicle here and pulled up behind it. As she approached the vehicle, she saw that there was a male in the car and he rolled the window down a small amount. And she was trying to talk to him and ask him why he was in the park and he wouldn't cooperate. She asked him to get out of the car and he wouldn't get out of the car. Now understand at this point, he's resisting a law enforcement officer in the performance of their duty. He's also violating a county ordinance. She retreats to her vehicle and she asks for additional backup because he is resisting her. At that time, among other deputies, Lieutenant Chad Anderson arrives and Deputy Sheriff Craig Smith. There are a total of four deputies and two trainees which are going through orientation and beginning the process to be full deputies next Monday that was working tonight. So they once again told him to get out of the vehicle. Little did they realize at that moment in time that this was a sovereign citizen he was Moorish. And Moorish sovereign citizens are known to believe that federal law, state law, local law does not apply to them. They are known to resist law enforcement. And there is a history where they shoot police officers. So they started trying to take our suspect out of the vehicle when he produced a gun and started shooting. There's about another 20 minutes to this video that I'm not going to show you. I'm going to put a link in the description. You can go watch the video on the news station down there. I just want to get this out as quick as uh, I can. Uh, so you may have heard about it already. Uh, one of my uh, subscribers let me know about it. So now I'm letting you know about it. It's very interesting. Uh, they actually unalive the guy at the end. So, thanks for watching. Bye.